And so the first one was likely an accident, the second one was an attack, and the third was a declaration of war. The publication of the Bush memoir fills in some of what we did not know about 9-11. But no official account so far addresses the issue now being raised in an extraordinary ad campaign. I lost my son, my nephew, my uncle, my son, on September 11th, 2001. Most people don't know that a third tower fell on September 11th. World Trade Center 7, a 47-story skyscraper, was not hit by a plane. Although the official explanation is that fire brought down Building 7. Over 1,200 architects and engineers have looked into the evidence and believe there is more to the story. Up until now, only those considered nut jobs question the official conclusion that office fires caused by the nearby catastrophe of the towers collapse brought down building number seven. But I do believe that it is the first time in history that fire has ever melted steel. I do believe that it defies physics for the World Trade Center Tower 7, building 7, which collapsed in on itself. It is impossible for a building to fall the way it fell without explosives being involved. And if explosives were involved, that would mean that the most obnoxious protesters in recent years Mine. are right. What's lurking? It's almost too perfect to be uncertain That the men behind the curtain ain't working to burn this bitch down to Nathan To decrease the population and stop the debating between us patrons We gotta stand up and stop falling for the pretend They got more money but we got more men Yeah the planes hit it and that's what we all saw But the survivors said that they heard explosions in the wall And booms from the basement and that's not all Ever heard about building 7? Well that's the third fall Come on you gotta call BS when you see it That's how we're not hit by a plane fell from fire, you don't believe it Go to YouTube and search controlled demolition And compare it to the towers falling, there's no difference Here's one of my favorites and no bullshitting They found a terrorist passport in mint condition Where all the bodies perish from the demolition The paper didn't burn and look new as addition I ain't a nutcase thinking the world is flat But me and many more got questions to be asked Stop sitting behind your Mac, it's time to react Time to protest with no rest until we get facts It ain't just zeitgeist and loose change It's about seeing through BS and using your brain But these architects and engineers, do they support your contention? Do you believe that it was an inside job, that 9-11 was an inside job? I, I believe it was an inside job And when lawyers... And you're asking the New York City Council, I don't right, want to we, what, also to right, reopen so I know, we don't have time, but anyway, he said, building what? Because he had, no one has a, any idea about building seven. So, because I believe in, I've talked to so many firemen, so many EMS workers, policemen, who talk about the explosions. And I know you don't want to get into my son, but I feel my son died from an explosion. I went to all the 9-11 commission hearings. I've, you know, I've been researching this for nine years. So and what do you want? Let's get to the bottom I want, I, I want truth. I've been lied to. I mean, it's beyond a reasonable doubt that the 9-11 Commission did not tell the story. 9-11 Commission barely mentioned Building 7. I'm, I'm, in, I'm into a conspiracy theory, man. That's my thing. You guys into that <laughs> You read that stuff I do. I think fast food. Fast food, I think, is like a conspiracy. You know? I think that's how they just keep us dumb. You can't even think after a while. You ever notice that <laughs> Like, if you have your whole day planned out, eat one egg McMuffin and it's on the couch, yeah, you know what? my dreams. <laughs> Thank you very much. It is a, an intriguing topic. I certainly am much more open-minded about it than I was, and it is because of the involvement of the 9-11 families and all these engineers and architects. Clearly, uh, they know I'm more just, than I do. I'm uh, you guys. Thanks. Right now Thank in you. this country, you can go to prison for like 10 years. Yeah, it's a bunch of bullshit. I know. I know, we have entered a whole new era where they can search your house without a warrant, they can, they can put you in jail without a trial. Eco-activists that have never harmed another human being are considered by our government to be more of a threat to national security than all of these right-wing Timothy McVeigh militia types. Well, right now I can't think of anything more patriotic than violating the Patriot. I'm writing these words as a gulf air passenger. I don't buy into the lies, I'm a challenger. Looking out my window, 40,000 feet high, they blame the crime on Islam. I wanna know why. As a smart man, I can never handle that. Jet fuel can melt down still like candle wax. This fraud's results is still astounding. The wicked shit they did killed over 3,000. Picture me, me and with the Pope in Sicily. To take a Mediterranean cruise to Tripoli. Meet with Gaddafi and fuse the nations. Increase the peace and life preservation. 
Let's wake up my people, there's still time On yourself with knowledge and get up on your grind Speak out on the lies, crimes and deceptions Don't stop the chain, it gets a lethal injection Deep breath, deep breath, I gotta take a deep breath All this is overwhelming, they got me ready to reset Bin Laden just got killed, they shot him in his dome And I thought that they would show him, but instead they went and thrown him Into the ocean for a Muslim sea burial So he could find Nemo and live with Ariel Sounds kind of fishy, pun intended, bear with me Why is it most of our history is a mystery? JFK, princes died of war in Iraq 9-11 and that bullshit Patriot Act I really truly hope that we ain't being lied to Cause all the men and women who died to Fight for my views and your views We're using the essence for a corporate came by going into war No repentance If you read between the lines then the lies surface Then you'll find a purpose when you look behind the curtain This isn't about good people versus bad people It's about the machine that's taking over this country It's like something out of science fiction The land, the cattle Human beings, this machine don't give a shit. Pennies a pound, pennies a pound. That's all it cares about. A few more pennies a pound. Divine. Sounds pretty bleak.